I actually got this role from my martial arts studio and just uh, never acted before, so I just went on auditions and, you know, process by process, I guess, I ended up that I got the part. Uh, getting the role on Super Ninjas was kind of a, a little bit of a journey. I came from South Carolina and moved to California so I could be an actor. Four and a half years later, I get the audition for this. I read the script. I'm like, this is awesome. Got to do it. Got lucky. And, uh, you know, now we're doing it. Well, I love Mike just because he reminds me a lot of, like, of myself. Uh, we can both be shy at times. We're both, uh, you know, we both know martial arts. We both collect action figures. And just, we're both, we're both each other. <laughs> well, I play Owen Reynolds, and I can relate to my character because there are, like, a lot of sides of Owen that you haven't seen. He's like this little onion, and you just keep pulling stuff back, and you keep seeing what's inside, you know what I mean? And, I mean, he's very funny, and he's very confident, but there are, like, other moments and, and feelings that you don't get to see all the time, and we keep revealing those throughout the episode. Uh, as the season goes along and I, I feel like that's kind of how I am. People see me one way and don't realize there's a lot of other things about me so that's what I like about my character. George always, always teaches us a little something every day. Working with George is really like having an acting teacher on set with you because he's been doing this for so long so he's teaching us as holograms on the show or grandfather on the show but then he's also teaching us in real life how to deal with, yeah. you know, this new business that we're all in. Oh, man, the most exciting thing I've done in the series, man, I, it would probably have to be uh, the episode two Ton Harley, where we were in these big fat suits. Oh, yeah, that was uh, yeah. it, it took a, quite a time getting in and out of those, Yeah. but um, <laughs> the result looked great, and being in them were just really fun, because you... you it, <laughs> It was just really comedic when, you, when you're trying to sit down and you're trying to figure out where the stool is and, and then your head gets and the, and, and the big fat thing goes over your head and you're just sitting there like a big turtle. It was exciting for me to play uh, chess, chess, not checkers, chess against checkmate on an episode, being on a giant chess board. And I can't play chess at all, so I, I didn't really know what I was doing. But it was still exciting to be in a, you know, human size game board. I've been doing uh, White Tiger Kung Fu for seven years, um, trained on over by the west side, and you know, just, it, it's a great program. Uh, How long have you been doing that, man? Seven years. Seven years? Seven years. Seven years. Seven years. Man. Seven. Se I seven. Got like, I got like seven less than that. <laughs> <laughs> you have a month. I got a month. You got a month. I do. I won a Young Artist Award for my performance on ER, and that was a uh, that was my first like, hey, I can do this type of a thing. You know what I mean? I was like, maybe acting is gonna work out for me. And you know, I, after that, I was it it was a big confidence boost to do those uh, shows that I was on, and it really helped me, you know, to get this role because then I understood how making these shows took place and it made me more of a professional and then I brought that when I came over to Super Ninjas. Some pranks take place but it's nothing too too much. Yeah, uh, but, but we're always coming up with some new things. Yeah, we um, like a uh, <laughs> like planning stage. And logging on to each other's Twitters and <laughs> all kinds of crazy <laughs> stuff. Changing the desktop backgrounds. Yeah, you know, just any electronic trick you can think of. Yeah. Locking but, other people's phones. And <laughs> but we gotta come up with some you know, some of the old pranks, like uh, you gotta whip out something the die, else. the invisible die, something you like that. You gotta do something yeah. crazy. I'm sure, you know, George yeah. Takei has some, you know. Oh, oh yeah. He probably, probably does. Shatner or something on yeah. Stuff like that. You never know. You know. We don't know. Uh, we'll see what he does. We'll see if he whips out some kind of prank on us. <laughs> Favorite TV shows and movies? I used to watch Holes. Uh -huh. I used to watch that movie over and over and over <laughs> again, and I like I love the Rush Hour movies, and uh, actually I used to watch a lot of Nickelodeon shows when I was younger, the All That's and Keenan and Kells and I, I watched just so much television, <laughs> uh, <laughs> a lot of Nickelodeon, a lot of cartoons, but um, my favorite movies are usually uh. Japanese movies. A lot of old Japanese movies are my favorite. The style? Yeah, the style. Nice. The samurais, you know, ninjas. 
Yeah, and now we're now doing, we're ninjas. Yeah. <laughs> Funnest part about being an actor is craft service. That is a good one. I'm just kidding. That no, you know what? <laughs> I'm weighing all the other options. You know, all the other perks of being on television. Craft services might have to be the one. I mean, the food is crazy. I think I think playing a, a different role, um, just whenever you're doing a different project, is really cool because you know I'm playing Mike, uh, Mike on this television show, but you know on a different project I might be Bob or you, you get to Larry. Expand, yeah, play a new character. You know, every day you come. Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for watching Super Ninjas, and stay tuned to the new episodes. We got some crazy villains. You don't want to miss that.